Advent means coming, and this is the time when we prepare ourselves for the coming of Christ. It begins on the fourth Sunday before Christmas and continues through Christmas Eve. Advent is not a time for celebration. That comes with Christmas. But rather it is a time of expectation and preparation. It also is a time for serious reflection on the nature of the expected Messiah, which is mentioned in many of the First Testament readings for the season. The Advent wreath is used in many churches and at home as a worship aid to help us prepare our hearts. The preparation of the wreath used at home is a wonderful activity and a lovely beginning to this special time of year. In many traditions, the wreath is a horizontal circle with four candles. The candles may be purple, signifying penitence, or blue for royalty. The third Sunday of Advent was traditionally Gaudete Sunday, a time of joy. For this reason, the third candle is sometimes pink or rose. Beginning on the first Sunday of Advent, the first candle is lit, accompanied by a Bible reading, prayers, and sometimes a song. Frequently, a fifth candle is placed in the center of the wreath, representing the Christ child, and this candle is lit on Christmas Eve. There is much symbolism in the wreath itself. The light anticipates the birth of Jesus Christ, who will bring light into the world. The circle represents eternity and the unity of God's creation. The evergreens are a symbol of enduring life during the darkness of winter. Even the specific type of evergreen can symbolize part of our faith tradition. Laurel may stand for victory over persecution and suffering. Pine, holiness, and yew would symbolize immortality. Cedar is for strength and healing. Holly represents the crown of thorns that Jesus wore on the cross. Each Sunday in Advent also has a special meaning. In some traditions, the first candle is the prophet's candle. The second candle is the Bethlehem candle. The third is the shepherd's candle. And the fourth is the angel's candle. In another tradition, the first candle is for hope, the second for peace, the third for joy, and the fourth love. We invite you to make your own wreath to use as a worship center this Advent season. It can be as simple as a circle of candles, or you may want to add evergreens, berries, pine cones, small ornaments, or whatever symbols are meaningful for you. You might even add flowers. Join us this year in this wonderful preparation for the coming of the light to the world.